And as far as the investigations are concerned, latest coming in that uh, electrical wires have been found in the body of uh, one of the blast victims, uh, Shoaib Ahmed, joining us uh, from Mumbai with the latest. Uh, Shoaib, uh, is this uh, significant? What are you gathering? So something which has come to the notice of the hospital authorities. A body at the JJ hospital, uh, they found some wires, some electrical wires which were stuck to the body of the victim. Now this they brought to the notice of the police. Police is now looking into it. Uh, it's, it's at this, it's a very, very initial stage at this point in time. But the hospital found something unusual about this body. That's why they have pointed it out to the police. Police is right now tight lip they'll try and find out whether this could be uh, a, 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 you know a case of somebody who would have got injured and perhaps a, a electrical shop nearby uh, you know some after the blast perhaps he would have got injured because of these wires or it could be something else where he could be part of the conspiracy itself too early to say anything on this but this has come to the notice of the police the hospital has brought it to the notice so this will also help in the investigation and police is taking a note of it like right that's a very interesting fact uh, that wires have been found uh, on the body of one of those victims uh, Shab, there's also fear uh, you know because of the torrential rain that we saw this morning that uh, some of the vital clues uh, might have been washed away that's right that was a very uh, clear and present danger right from uh, yesterday evening itself because while we were reporting at that point in time itself when i visited the spotted opera house i could see nothing in fact it was difficult to spot even blood over there because the wa uh, water the rain which was there had washed away a lot of stuff but the home minister in the press, con press conference today claimed that uh, the cfsl officials experts have managed to get uh, uh, gather a lot of samples from all the blast sites so that is encouraging sign it it remains to be seen uh, if uh, the investigation it, it, it suffers a setback at this stage because of rains or because of any other uh, any other reason at the initial sp uh, stage itself where evidence collection is concerned then it could be a problem but the home minister is claiming they are fine as of now they have cctv footage which they are examining and also the fact that now they know that ammonium nitrate was used perhaps a timer was used in it these are the things that they are closely uh, focusing on right now